click on the bell. Once the bell is clicked, you will get all notification. Thank you. Hello everyone, please welcome and join me in Seps Cooking. Today my lady cooking made a special doll. It's a vegetarian dish and it's very healthy, very nutritious. It's a muscle and mungi combination. Perfect doll. She made it healthy, nutritious and special doll. She added spinach in it and mushroom. And I love mushroom. Mushrooms are very nutritious, very healthy. We always eat doll. Bringing excitement into our cooking by adding these things, it makes it delicious. And the taste, mm. I cannot put the words how tasty it is. I just have to simply say delicious. Mm. These mushrooms, these mushrooms cook to the perfection. Without wasting any time, my lady cooking will show you how to make such a delicious and nutritious and healthy doll in easy steps and let's go to see her in the kitchen to make up a delicious doll we're going to need combination of doll half cup of masar which looks like this and then half cup zumungi doll wash this doll with the cold water we're going to use a three cup of water and we're going to put it in pressure cooker only two spices one teaspoon turmeric powder and one teaspoon salt so that one cup of doll wash with the cold water so we're going to drain the water so we're going to open the pressure cooker there is no more water the wash doll into the pressure cooker we're going to bring three cup of water and uh, all together with the doll we're going to use four cup of water one cup water we're going to use it later that going to be hot cup of water and when to use it that i'm going to share with you we're going to add turmeric powder which is a uh, one teaspoon and one teaspoon we're going to add salt these are only two ingredients we needed cover the pressure cooker with the lid and we're going to put it on a gas we're going to give one whistle and we're going to start gas and we're going to wait for one whistle mustard seed garam masala cumin powder coriander powder cumin seed deghi mate ginger garlic all of these spices will be one teaspoon each one green serrano chili i'm going to use a half onion one small tomato I'm going to use one tablespoon olive oil and one tablespoon unsalted butter. This will be strictly optional. If you don't want to use it, please skip it. Along with the fresh tomato, I'm going to use a quarter cup tomato sauce. The spinach, one cup spinach, half cup I kept it to show you and half cup I cut it. So I'm, what I'm going to do, I'll cut the rest. These mushrooms pre-washed and uh, ready to cook so i'm going to use half of it that will be 10 ounces and let's start tadka we have our uh, first whistle and uh, it took us uh, like uh, eight minutes and we're going to turn off the gas and now we're going to let it sit until it cools down we're going to work on our tadka and for tadka we're going to get a pot and we're going to start gas take off the lid and now we're going to bring olive oil and we're going to bring one tablespoon as the oil start to heat up, we're going to bring uh, unsalted butter. We're going to bring a cumin seed and a mustard seed. And mix it. We're going to give like a 10 seconds. And now we're going to bring ginger, garlic. Mix it. And we're going to cook like 20 30 seconds. So now we're going to bring onion. We're going to saute our onion. Keep moving until it uh, gets uh, translucent. Cooking our onion for two minutes. Now we're going to bring green chili. Mix it well. To cook additional one minute. So another minute cooking with the green chili. Now we're going to bring the spices. Grind a powder, cumin powder, garam masala. 
the ghee milk and we're going to mix it well. We don't want to overcook our onion because uh, the dal itself is a uh, yellowish dal and we don't want to have a burnt onion in there. So the onions are transparent, that's good. Now we're going to bring the tomatoes and the same time we're going to bring tomato sauce. Mix it well. So now we're going to bring our gas to medium and we're going to cover with the lid and we're going to cook it for two minutes. Cooking for two minutes on medium flame. Now we're going to open it and mix it well. Our tomatoes are tender. So any tomatoes are like that, you can mash it. So they're really soft now. So after mashing the tomatoes, now we're going to bring the, the mushroom. And now we're going to mix it well. We're still cooking on a medium flame. Once all the spices are nicely combined, we're going to cover with the lid. So on the medium flame, we're going to cover with the lid and we're going to cook it for five minutes. The whole reason we want it cook it so that the mushroom can release all its water contents and it will be well cooked. Cooking our mushroom with the closed lid for five minutes on medium flame. Now we're going to open it. Mushroom has released all the water and now we're going to mix it well. After mixing it well, we're going to bring our gas on a high. So we're going to cook with open lid and it keeps stirring so it won't get burned at the bottom. When we're going to press the mushroom backward, there is still little water content if you see the gravy is there. But once the oil is going to start splitting up, it starts to ooze out, that's where it's going to be nicely cooked. The mushrooms are nicely cooked and tender. As you see, that oil starts to ooze out. So now it's fully cooked, we're going to bring the spinach, all up. So mix it well. Bring over gas on medium. So keep mixing it until it's nicely incorporated with our masala. And now we're going to open our pressure cooker and we're going to bring the dal. So we're going to open the pressure cooker and there is no more pressure inside. So we can open it and we can see our dal. Let's see. Oh, it looks so nice. Perfect. So now we're going to bring dal into our pot. So we're going to bring it inside the pot. Just be careful when you're putting it inside. Don't uh, spill on yourself or don't get burned. Now we're going to mix it. So we're going to bring our gas to low while mixing it. So it's nicely mixed and now we have a, our hot water ready. We're going to get one cup. Please make sure that use hot water. Don't use cold water at this moment. And we're going to put it in. So after adding the water and mixing it well, as you see the consistency of the dal, this is what we are looking for. So look at this, the dal and the mushroom. The consistency is there. And this is what exactly we want. We don't want really running gravy. So we're going to bring our gas on number two. We're going to cover with the lid. We're going to cook it only two minutes. On a number two, cooking for two minutes with the cover lid. Now we're going to turn off the gas. And we're going to open the lid. Look at our delicious dal. And this is a perfect. We're going to get our serving bowl and we're going to dish out. Our very tasty and perfect dal, very delicious, very nutritious and very healthy is all ready. You can serve with the roti, chapati, naan, fulka, prantha. I mean, name it. And best of all, rice fluff. And you will love it. Please try it. If you like it, like always, please like, share and subscribe Easy Steps Cooking. Thank you.